Module four, track your unstoppable progress. In order to smash through your limitations and achieve your goals, you need to track and celebrate the progress you're making. Even the small wins are wins. Perhaps the biggest aha moment that I had in this entire process of getting my life together and moving towards my amazing future was that no one is coming to save me. You have to be willing to put in the work and you don't have an infinite amount of time to accomplish your dreams. If not now, when? Setting yourself up for success means putting in the time. Get into a routine and evaluate where you are. The road to your future requires continuous progress. Check and recheck. Nothing happens overnight. Remember, no fairy godmother. How fast or slow getting to your end goals depends on how much time you put into working on your milestones. For continuous tracking and unstoppable progress, schedule time weekly to spend planning your week. I use Sunday afternoons to prep for the week and figure out what things I can do this week to hit my goals and reestablish my intent towards the results I want to achieve for the week. Hang your worksheet somewhere that you can see them so it's in your face reminding you of where you are. Hang it on the fridge, pin it to a board in your room or office. Write yourself reminders, get sticky notes or a glass marker or a dry erase marker and write your key items on a mirror you use each day. Write your why. I've written myself reminders on the microwave door, the window over the kitchen sink, and the bathroom mirror. As you go through this entire process and start using the system, somewhere inevitably you're going to get off course or pause for a bit, or you're going to get frustrated with the speed at which you're progressing. The system really is this simple. Understand where you want to be versus where you are now. Get really clear on why you want to get there and have a plan to track your progress. It's in some of the simplest wins that you can celebrate where you are. By tracking your progress, you can also see how far you've come and what needs more attention. Some of the plans that you have may be very complex to achieve and have a lot of milestones that you need to accomplish before you achieve the biggest overarching goal. There are a few additional tools that I want to share with you to keep your forward progressive mindset. Incantations and mantras. A mantra literally means a tool for your mind. Module four, handout one, incantations worksheet. I want you to write out your mantra, your incantation for how you're going to show up daily in this journey for your future. It doesn't have to be anything complicated. A mantra literally is a tool for the mind, something that you can recite that helps give you the vibration for which you're mindfully focused on your thoughts, feelings at your highest intention. Here are some examples. I am in control of my life. I have the power to make it extraordinary in every way. I am the force that drives my future and I will not let me down. I am the author of my destiny and the captain of my ship. I chart a course to the future to live the life I have always dreamed. I refuse to let the critics who aren't even playing the game derail me from the greatness I am becoming. Every day in every way, I'm getting stronger and stronger. I will not let limitations slow me down and prevent me from being who I was meant to be. I want you to post this somewhere where you can see it every day. Every day I want you to look at it, recite it, and feel it. Use the worksheet to capture those that are most meaningful for you, or write your own. Here are some simple examples. My mind is brilliant, my body is healthy, my spirit is tranquil. I am conquering my fears and becoming stronger each day. My potential is limitless and I choose where I spend my energy. My commitment to myself is unbreakable. I am worthy of the very best life and now I lovingly allow myself to accept it. I am capable of every dream and worthy of every desire. Wake up, kick ass, be kind. Appreciation, gratitude, and suffering. You can't suffer when you're in a state of gratitude. 
How do you self-regulate? Sustain staying in state and on track? Get still and put your intention on your heart. Change your breathing. It takes practice. Trade frustration, resentment, impatience for gratitude and appreciation and thankfulness. There will come a moment where you're feeling thankful for nothing specific at all. In gratitude, you're in the perfect state of receiving. Start a gratitude journal or do a gratitude meditation on a daily basis to keep yourself grounded in the right mindset. Get into a daily ritual. Now, I know this kind of growth can be kind of uncomfortable. You might feel, and this is one of those limiting beliefs, stupid for standing in front of the mirror, chanting an incantation or gratitude to yourself. Change within the context of your own beliefs can be hard. You've never been this new version of you. Give yourself a little bit of grace and breathe through it. I still have days where I look back and know that I could have done better, especially as I show up daily as a leader. A lot of time I get to the end of a situation and tell myself the next time I'm going to do even better at listening before speaking, thinking before acting. The truth is your goals are achievable and they're achievable for you because of your why. The thing about goals is they keep growing, but if you're not growing along with them, making forward progress, you're probably not going to be happy for long after you achieve one. Think back to something really amazing that you accomplished before and all the hard work that you put into it. How long were you excited about that goal? Progress becomes an important part of moving forward and continuous progress becomes an important part of maintaining your mental state and it all flows into itself. Don't forget to celebrate every win, no matter how small, a step in the right direction is still a step in the right direction. Everyone dreams from a very early age what their life could be. The difference between you and everyone else is that now you have a plan. A heartfelt thanks goes out to everyone who bought this course. As you know, my why is that I am trying to leave a legacy of improvement in the world so that my time here was not for nothing. Creating this course and the others to come is a way for me to take the things that I learned and give back. And I greatly appreciate anyone taking even 10 minutes to work on improving their life and their state. Because by spending any time making yourself even better than you are, you impact everyone around you. So again, a heartfelt thank you goes out to everyone who purchased this course. If you want additional training or help, we do offer one-on-one and group coaching and mentoring programs. Email us at levelupstronger at gmail.com for more information. We have a regular blog and podcast at levelupstronger.com and at all the social media outlets, we are at levelupstronger.